patrons. Today is first day of EDC and I'm not naked I promise. I'm in a Hollister bathing suit I guess you would say. Wearing the new Stila thing. Not sure how I feel about it. We are on our way to go eat and from there we're probably gonna go to the pool. Are you recording right now? Oh, okay. I didn't know you were recording. I thought you were just like... Gorgeous. Absolutely and insanely gorgeous. Those eggs look gross though. Look how wet this is. So we just ate and we are heading back to the room. I'm gonna drop my camera off. We're going to the pool. But I am still taking my phone, which means that I'm gonna bring you guys with me. So here's a couple videos of us walking into the venue on the first day. Honestly, Vegas was so hot. We got there at 3 p.m. Everything was blocked off because nothing opened until 6. So I'd probably recommend if you guys were going that you'd go a little later. Me and Jaime, when it started, we ended up playing in a ball pit. We played by the pool. We just messed around for a little bit. It was so much fun being VIP. All right, so this is day two outfit of the day. You got this cool candy mask, my Nega Moon jewelry. You got my bodysuit. I just threw on some shorts because it's a little revealing. Obviously my candy, fishnet tights, heart, garter legs. There you go, forgot the word for a second. I'm rocking my Nike kicks. Oops, falling over. All right, fanny pack. I'm about ready to go. Let's see what Jaime's wearing. Jaime, my love. Come here. Hi. So he's got these cool kitten shorts, some Nikes, Volcom shirt. Hey, hello. So yeah. No. This is pretty nice. I'm enjoying this. Hmm. Yes. Hmm. Uh huh. Yes. <laughs> Apparently, Haim is not going. So that's it. I'm not going. Just kidding, I paid too much not to go. While me and Jaime were getting ready for EDC, when we were said and done, we went downstairs to see my mom working on the Billboard Awards. She actually let me Fabian for a couple minutes to drive us to our car in the golf cart. It was so much fun. Thank you, Fabian. You're awesome. I love you, Mom. EDC. Actually, we're just going to the parking lot. He's like, it's nice. Hi, everybody. Hey. All the way across, right? Yes, we're on parking lot we're level two. Two H, two H, something like that. We're on our way to EDC day two. I'm super excited. Look at this makeup. Uh -huh. Right? This blue eyes, yes. 
Thank you. Right. So we're driving. Look at all this traffic. This is nothing compared to what we're gonna be in in like two seconds. Hello! People are so nice here. I enjoy this. Bumper to bumper traffic, 30 to 45 minutes to an hour, it didn't matter. Then when we got there the second day, full of a sea of people just to get into the line to get into the actual venue. Like, ugh! Being in this line definitely sucked. It took an hour and a half to get through it. We had to get our bags checked, make sure that we didn't have any illegal substances. But after we got out, we walked towards the actual line to get into the venue. And from there, it was smooth sailing. Uh, we did have a VIP entrance, but it didn't really make a difference because everybody was immediately just going in through and they weren't checking anything. So it was a hit and a miss at the same time. You know the meme with Michelle Tanner where she's running and she says, I have little legs? That, that was me about a second ago. Seeing everything in the night was so much better than seeing it in the daytime, honestly. There was lights, there was airplanes, owls, there was rides beyond belief, naked people everywhere. I mean, the feeling of being there was just epic, honestly. I can't even explain how I feel on that. was definitely worth it. We had our own restricted access places that were VIP only. Uh, we had great food. We had early access to all the rides. We had a ball pit, a pool, an arcade. There was tons and tons of things that were specific to us that we enjoyed. I definitely took advantage of all of the burrito stands and the candy making station. I fell in the ball pit a couple times, but after a little while they actually decided to close it and I was super, super sad. Look at my Wreck-It Ralph, isn't he so cute with his kitty nose? Ugh, I had such a great time. <laughs> Remember what I said about little legs? He was literally pulling me along everywhere. Let's go check it out. After wandering around for a little bit, we realized what time it was and rushed over to Kinetic Field where we saw Tiesto and Marshmallow. So here's a couple clips of that. Each DJ did a beautiful memoir to Avicii and they all displayed pictures of him and played his music. It was really, really great. I was having a great time, even better out of all of this, someone who's A1 in my books was some random guy that was next to us in this whole crowd fanning people. He had the mask on, this guy right there, right next to me. He is A1 in my book, oh my gosh, he made everything 10 times better. On the third day, me and Jaime actually ended up chilling. We just went to random stages. We saw Paul Van Dyke. It was definitely super, super exciting, but we were just burnt out at this point. EDC ended 
up having a ton of different music and a ton of different styles that everyone can enjoy and it was definitely something I'm going to remember and hope that I get to go next year. Woo!